Hi there everyone, welcome to Technoholic. In this video, I'll be talking about how you can download latest and greatest Microsoft Office 2024 in your system. And I will try to make this guide as easy as possible. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay, so first of all, let me press this menu button and now type EDGE. This will open our internet browser. Now what we need to do here is we need to type following which is Office customization tool and then hit enter then we need to go to following link and again not to worry guys i'm gonna provide you this direct link in the description of this video just you need to go down and need to click on this link now coming back to this page from here you need to select this as 64 then from office suit let's select office 2024 professional plus or I would say depending on the license that you have, you can select any of this version. Now let's go down and here what you will find is option to customize your setup. And I really like this step guys because you know if there is an app that you do not use then why we bother to install it? Why we make our PC run slow? Let's only install that app that I am going to use. So I may exclude access from this and then uh, probably I'm going to also exclude publisher. So in this way guys, we can customize this whole setup. Let's say by default you turned any particular app off that you want to add again, then select that app. So in this way, you can completely customize your office setup. This will also help you to reduce your office download file that we're going to do in our next step. Now click next. From here, you can choose language. So I'm going to go with English. So let me select English here. If you want to go with additional language, you can choose additional language as well. Now I'm going to click on next, next. Now here in the setting, let's say you would like to uninstall your previous installation. If you want to keep your previous off installation, then you can turn this setting off. Now let's click on next again, next, and then finally click on finish. Now go down here. Click on export, select the second option and click OK. Accept terms and condition, click export. And then if you're going to see this kind of error, then please click on keep. And there we go, guys. Here we have downloaded this configuration file. Now, since you will be downloading this file for the first time, I'm going to make it easier for us to understand. So I will be deleting this extra bracket one written here. OK. Now the next step what I'm going to do here is I'm going to copy this configuration.xml and let's click on desktop here. Let's click on new folder and let's type office hit enter and again open this folder and paste the copied configuration XML file that we have just downloaded. Now we need to open another link which is office deployment tool. Again, I'm going to provide you the link so that you can directly reach to this page. Now after, let's click on download. Now after the file got download, here you will see it in download. Simply click on open file, click on yes. If in case you do not see your download, press Ctrl and J and then again you will able to see it. Or you can click on show in folder. Here also you will able to find it. All you need to do is you need to make a double click on it. Now let's click on accept, continue. Now I'm going to select the folder that we have just created and that folder was in our desktop. So let me expand this desktop and here we have got this office. So let me click on OK. Now here it says file extracted successfully. Now I'm going to hit OK again. Let's click on desktop office and there we go. So here we can see we have added these two new files. Now I'm going to delete this particular one and this file we have created in step first. So in this way, we have completed step one and step two. Now the third and last step is downloading the setup. Now again, I'm going to provide you this command that you need to copy. So simply copy this command like this and then uh, press menu button type CMD and then run it as an administrator. Now I think I also require to copy this path. So I'm going to click here on the top, copy the path, then go again to CMD. Now type here CD and then space and make a right click. This will paste the path. Now I'm going to hit enter. Now I will be copying this command. After copying the command, let's paste it here. After pasting the command, let's press enter. And there we go, guys. Here we can see the process of download and installation has begun. 
all you need to do now is just sit back relax or maybe if you want to do some other activity do that because this process is going to take a while based on how fast internet connection you have because this will download around 2 to 5 gigabyte of data so let's wait for a while and there we go guys here we can see we have successfully downloaded and installed microsoft office in our system now let's click here on close and we can also close this command prompt now let's click here on menu button and look for app for example microsoft word let's open it and there we go so here we can see we have successfully installed latest and greatest office 2024 in our system now let me click here on file go to account and here what you need to do is you need to sign in using your office account so if you bought office 2024 using your email address then you need to use the same else what we can do is we can also enter our office product key that will also help us to activate microsoft office in this particular case i have used office product key so that's how guys by entering product key we can activate microsoft office that's all guys from my side in this video i hope that you find this video helpful and informational if so then please do like and subscribe to technoholic to see more such content related to office productivity and i will catch you soon with one such another video till then you take care and bye bye